all right guys this is a quick video actually I just discovered uh, yesterday that even uh, this uh, D tab lens uh, can also do autofocus on the Nikon mirrorless bodies uh, using the FTZ adapter now this is a D tab lens this is 80 to 200 uh, AFS silent wave motor uh, 2.8 D type uh, comes with DD glass all this way of course it doesn't have the um, those uh, mm, optical images uh, stabilizer or VR um, you can see the focus is there all right now here's the thing when I turn it on but before we turn it on and please make sure that the aperture ring is basically connected on not 2.8 it should be connected on 2 in this way the camera have a communication uh, with the lens and all the active data is coming from the lens to the to the camera body let me show you how so if you turn it on you see 2.8 so if I'm changing the aperture from the front dial you see the, the aperture is changing right all right but if I change look at this focus on here 22 and when I change this to it gives me error so basically the communication is break from here to so I have to keep this thing on F22 keep focusing on here when I change this back to 22 look what happened 22 it's back to normal so this is the first point that there's communication for uh, uh, tra transmitting the active data from the lens to the camera body even though the autofocus will work but I'll show you in a minute so I turned the camera on I made this back autofocus button for focusing and look what happens wait 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 I have to remove this lens hood I have to remove this uh, lens cap all right okay so here is the camera so look what happens the moment I'm pressing this it's basically auto focusing and it's quite fast I mean considering the D-Dipole technology it's considerably fast so these hold these hold D-Type lenses are basically uh, focusing on the mirrorless bodies very efficiently no questions asked let me show you again So, but again, this is because these lenses are having the AFS motor. That's why. That's why I'm able to uh, do the auto focusing on these uh, lenses uh, through the uh, these parallel bodies. So, if you have a pure D type lens which have no solid wave motor and only works on the screw drive then definitely uh, the, uh, the camera is not going to focus because the FTZ adapter and the camera body they doesn't have the motor drive autofocus system just because it has the electronic that they, the, uh, the silent wave motor EFS they are able to do the autofocusing so that's it guys I thought to share with you quick uh, that uh, that's a good finding actually nobody made any video on this I haven't came across anything so I probably is going to be the first one I guess or maybe I'm kind of late or maybe I am the first one regardless so anybody who has these uh, AFS motors uh, silent wave motor AFS D tab lenses yeah you can do it out of focus by the way um, 
the high auto focus was working perfect on this machines see I switched to 16 and this is what I am getting ok so I am going to switch back to 22 okay, working back again by the way yeah I have to be on AFC and automot uh, automatic these in order to make the uh, that uh, I have to be on AFC and this automatic area selection so only using that uh, I can I can make the eye out of focus work it has to be over here not single point group focus or a white single or white large I cannot choose any of them it has to be on auto and then I can and it has to be on AFC not on AFS or manual focus it has to be on AFC only then I auto focus work in only these two combinations alright so that's it guys I hope you can like this video I'm going to enjoy the I auto focus tracking on these old D type mirrorless bodies, D type lens or mirrorless bodies. <laughs> That's it. Take care. And I am at Nikon Center because I have to go and return this Z7. Thank you very much, and I'll catch you guys later. Bye.